Now go high level is a super powerful all-in-one marketing tool. However, when it comes to the pricing, it really can get complicated quite fast. For example, there is the starter plan, but what's the difference to the unlimited plan? You are going to get all of the features. What does the unlimited plan offer more than the starter plan? Additionally, there is also a third option, which you probably don't know about if you are just using the public high level site. Now, quick little disclaimer, if you do want to sign up to high level, you can get my exclusive offer where you are going to get an extended 30 day free trial, a free live bootcamp, as well as my bonuses worth over $2,000, including this beautiful funnel template, all for free, simply by just using my affiliate link down below when signing up to high level. So let's get into the starter plan and let's see if it's worth it. Now, essentially on the starter plan, you are going to get all of the tools which you are going to need you aren't going to be restricted in any way. So you aren't going to get any additional features when it comes to email marketing, automations, website builders, and so on in the unlimited plan, for example. The only real significant difference is that on the starter plan, although you are going to get all of the features, you are only going to have the option to set up free sub accounts, meaning that the unlimited plan, for example, where you are going to get unlimited sub accounts is going to be a better option for agencies, for example. Also, on the unlimited plan, you can set up a branded desktop app with a custom domain and so that you can basically slightly customize it. And the third option, the SaaS Pro option, will basically allow you to fully white label high level to your likings so that you can basically sell it as your own little SaaS. So essentially, when is the starter plan worth it? The starter plan is going to be worth it if you are just going to use high level for the features for your own business. Maybe you are going to have a website and you do want to use the high level website builder, then the starter plan is going to be worth it for you. Otherwise, if you, for example, are going to build up an agency, then either the unlimited plan or the SaaS Pro plan is going to be a way better option. Either way, I will leave you a link to the free trial down below so that you can just try out high level on yourself and so that you can then see which plan is going to be the best one for you. I really hope this was helpful. If it was, make sure to like and subscribe and I will see you in the next one.